Hello, fellow sermon writers, Rodamon here. Thank you for tuning in to Graveyard Keeper, episode 14, Attempted Sermon. All right, I have an apiary. Uh, you guys want a new sermon with the faith? Uh, so what am I, what is my next goal? Uh, for me to get a new sermon, I'll have to go into the church basement, I guess. I'll figure out what is required for that. And you guys are voting on what I'm doing after I get said sermon. So get a better sermon. I, to be honest, might not have the chops or, or necessary resources to do it, but I'll, I will check. Um... Also, I, I want to get my plant on, but I don't have any peat, I don't think. No peat in there. Alright, this is getting put away. Is there like a... Oh, okay, holding shift, cool. Well, I'm already in the cellar, so let's go over to the, uh, the church basement. Figure out this requirement of mine. Because I've never, um, I've never made a sermon before. And, uh, yeah, it's probably more complex than I understand. Like, I don't understand what I'm looking at at all. I guess there's the quality of the source material. And then whether you have perks of industriousness, playwright and writer. So let's, where is that? That's writer, that's playwright. And then industrious. Hmm. Is it in here? Not that, unless it's here, I don't know. Well, somewhere. Uh, Alright, so we're going to improve the church and graveyard. And improve the church graveyard. So I'll have you guys decide on the sermon that I'm going to get. Because uh, I, I don't know at all what the options are. Uh, so it looks like there's a prayer of faith. So the prayer of faith... So chapter, book, chapter, chapter. So, uh, chapters and books. So, cha um, I know how to make chapters and I can unlock books pretty easy because that I already have the materials for that. Uh, all right. So all of the, all that we're looking at, I think I have the source material for. So there's the prayer of faith combo prayer. Is there a way to see, I don't see the... The, um, what it does. Where is that? That must be in theology. So, the prayer of faith. So, here's the prayer of faith. Uh, it's a 10 to 30 needed to guarantee a successful ceremony. I think I have a 25 church. Um, it will give you a commercial blessing, which will improve one vendor. Uh, that's prayer of prosperity. So, what prayer to get? Prosperity, and I, I need to make sure that prosperity is one on the uh, yeah prosperity is on the um, on the chart. Uh, then there is donations, uh, one to fifty to guarantee successful, and I can count on extra donations. So that would be good for for donations at the end of a sermon. Uh, there's the combo prayer, which is extra faith and donations. And then 
or faith combo donation. So there's also prayer of faith in here, which maybe I just have access to. Oh, that's this one. So 10 to 50 and it will produce more faith. Uh, the fifth option here that I'm going to add is unlock a new one because it's possible that I, um, uh, it, it's possible that I, I spend some points to just get a new one, like prayer of repose. I could probably afford. So all deceased are welcome in my graveyard. I, uh, so maybe that attracts zombies or something. I have no idea, but, or I could get repentance. Um, it's about sin and forgiveness based on a couple of stories from my youth. I don't. So sermon money is 10% bonus. Sermon faith is 25 to 75%. So there's like modifiers. Um, for faith and money as a result of these things. Back Red Runner and uh, Hippie. Thank you for the, for the resubs. All right. It looks like overwhelmingly you guys want me to do combo. So for a combo, I need books. So I'm going to get book writing unlocked. And for a book, ah, I see. So I'm not going to be able to do the combo prayer immediately because the writing the combo prayer itself requires seven faith and writing a book. Um, Cause this what a hardcover book. No, no, I'm looking for the wrong thing. Where is book? Is this book? Is that the same icon? No, that's not the same icon. This is the research table, right? Yeah. What well, better book means better prayer. Yeah, I get that much. Um, oh, is that book? Why do they use different symbols? I am so confused. Book is a different tool. All right. Uh, let, let me try to figure out what tool that is. Oh, wait, did I not just unlock book? I guess I didn't. Hang on. So taking a look at the prayer. Here it is. So book crafted at desk or desk to or workbench. And I could make a desk. So let's go make a desk. So that was Flitch and Nails. Probably going to be out of like stamina. But whatever. I think it was one more Flitch than I currently. I think it was eight Flitch. So I got to cut down a tree. Nothing like, dang it, I need a book. Let me go cut down a tree. Like, <laughs> okay, that's pretty enterprising, but all right. I was just at the desk. Was that a desk? All right, I need to go back down now. So this is a church workbench. And this is a desk. Oh, so this makes books, but where? I don't see, is this book? Yeah, this must be book. Uh, so book has different symbols for seemingly no reason other than to confuse me. Is that how I should interpret this? Oh, God. All right. So book requires a soft cover um, and chapters. Or alternatively, a hard cover. And hard cover would be better than soft cover. Yeah. So hard cover is better than soft cover and the higher quality hard covers would be best. All right. So hard covers. 
Uh, that would be in book writing. Is made at a trick work, work, workbench. All right, so that's made here. I don't have steel parts. Um, I don't have tanning agent. So I'm just going to make a soft cover, I guess, with pigskin paper. Because that's the best I can do at the moment. So I'm going to get two pigskin paper. And then I'll also need chapters. No, you already came? Oh, uh, I can fix that. Mm, it's fixed. Oh, there's not much to look at. The back turned. And I'm too tired. <laughs> Dig in, little man. So I've got the soft cover now. This is going to be one heck of a bad prayer. Maybe it'll still be improvement, though. So now I need a chapter. And a chapter is notes, and notes is stories, ink and pen, and clean paper. So I need, um... I have stories, but I need, uh... Ink and pe pen and inks. So pen and inks is made at the Jerk Watch Bank. And that is feathers and ink. Ink is flasks, water, and black paint. Black paint is made in an alchemy workbench. So then I need an al alchemy workbench. Man, it's like... And that needs advanced conical flasks, which I'm not sure I have. No, I have it. I have it. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. It kind of reminds me of the... Uh, I watched a video not too long ago about a dude trying to make his own fried chicken sandwich from scratch. Like, scratch, scratch, milling, and like everything from scratch. And it was, uh, it was, it was epic. Took a while. Uh, so I have to wait for the um, furnace to finish the steel. So I think in the meantime, I will make some additional uh, gravestone fences because the other priority is to improve the church. And I don't mind getting extra blue research. This will be done pretty soon, I think. Definitely not going to be done by the time uh, the next prayer sermon comes around. So there's one more iron to be smelted. I'll go figure out what graves to improve in the meantime. Probably check up on my peat. You know what I realized is like all the other farm fields were um were nice and fertilized and I should probably have just 
planted. What is going on with that top one? Why can't I fertilize that? No? Ah, this is really annoying. I can't tell which tile I'm standing on. Ah, oh, there we go. It lets you double fertilize. That's, uh... Ran into that problem before. So I guess the text is at the top of the tile, not the bottom. Um, that can't benefit. Nope. Yes. I didn't even check if this could benefit. I just removed it. teeter-tottering on maximum quality given that most of the graves that are buried here uh, won't benefit from any additional any well, anything additional. Let's see if the furnace is ready. So the next order of business is the two um, yes, it is ready. Good. The two conical flasks. So I need the regular conical flasks, which I already have downstairs. Something I actually had in advance. Uh, I don't have enough firewood. Well, I can fix that. Well, I'll get uh, I'll get one of the flasks going because I know it's a timed thing. So it's five minutes to wait in total or whatever. Well, while I wait for that... I can plant some... Oh, did it just finish? Plant some new stuff. I think it was four seeds a plot. Well, I'll just grab all the seeds. What I ought to do is just... Because... Yeah, I, I should probably just buy up more seeds and... With the money I'm making off the sermons. Although, I'll be given another sermon soon. So, maybe I'll do that uh, once the new sermon is done. Or once I give the next one. Some more hemp and more beet. I ought to build related boxes in every zone. I, I get that now. Uh, And I also have some feathers for the ink and pen. Come on, flask. Wow, it's like Watching paint dry. All right, uh, what can I do in the meantime? Can't I build a trunk in the garden? Yeah, I, I can. I'm, I'm gonna wait until it becomes voted on though, as I do with everything else. So if vote building something becomes a goal or organizing or some something along those lines, I'll, I'll go ahead and do it.
But right now, my goal was to improve the graveyard. So I'm getting more stones so I can make more... Um, gravestones and the like. That was weird. Thought my inventory was full. Nope. Just the stone refused to fly into me. Now we're flasking. Oh, it was a 3 to 3 ratio. Cool. I, I'll make more advanced conical flasks anyway. Because perhaps I'll use them. But, uh, so now I have the flasks for... The alchemy workbench. So I'll figure out the rest of the costs. Uh, but it is sermon day, and I am sleepy. Noted. So that would be three complex parts and six planks. Do not have the planks. Once the once I'm done planing those the flitches into planks, we'll be all set. Sermon time! Old sermon, but sermon time. Uh, wait. Uh, there's my stairs. So the good news about this is, um, the book required faith and then the, the, um, the new sermon, the combo sermon required faith, so I'm getting the faith that I need. Church is great. Let's click through this, so that's five. Plus. Oh, they said okay. Oh, those are pretty good donations. For now, I'm sure, you know, late game, they get a lot better. Oh, that was more money than the last time. Sweet. Uh, another question for you all, I figure, is uh, tech to unlock. I'm not going to read the options this time, you'll just have to vote blind. So I've got the parts. Let's get down there, make myself an al alchemical bench.
Uh. <laughs> okay. Uh. All right, where was I? Why do I need that? I don't remember anymore. So this, I need books. Books require chapters. Chapters require pen and ink. Oh, right, because the ink, oh, okay, yeah. And then the ink requires black paint. Um. So you know that lecture I was giving before about how the game doesn't tell you squat? Cool, uh, I will totally understand how to make black paint. With this very informative user interface that tells me nothing. Okay. Uh, yeah. Um. So, question for you guys: Don't tell me the recipe. But is there a way to figure out in game? How to make black paint or is it something that I just have to start mixing stuff together or ultimately just something that I have to wiki because as far as I could tell all right it looks like we're gonna do some anatomy one uh, I will do advanced alchemy so now I have the uh, the ability to make an al alchemy Chemical Bench Level 2. There is a way someone sells recipes. Okay. Got it. So right as I built the old one, I have a new one. There's also a mill. Alchemy mill that I'm probably going to want sooner or later, I imagine. Distillation cube. So there's a ton of alchemy stuff that I might need. Um, should I continue trying to make the pen and ink or just buy it? Because I know that the astrologer sells it, if I recall. Uh, so I could just buy it rather than go continue to go down this rabbit hole of long lists of things that I need to make. I don't, I don't, I, I have no dog in this fight. I don't really care. What is required for the flyers? Also, pen and ink. Okay. And while you put on that, I will take a look at my, uh... So in the church, what could I improve? Stained glass windows, but like that is a little beyond my price point at the moment. grave markers so far some of these graves could be Im improved but I don't I don't have the unlocks to do it three stone grave markers okay so three stone grave markers is pretty much as good as I can get my graveyard for now and you guys want me to buy it copy that uh, it's going to be a while until the astrologer shows up. Um, that day has passed.
Hey, it's fire. Thank you for the resub. So I'll continue to improve the graveyard and then I'm not really sure. I think at that point I will have hit a a brick wall um, for progress. At that point, for me to improve the graveyard more, I'm going to need exhumation orders to be able to remove corpses I don't like or the corpses that are um, worthless or however you want to frame it. Remove those from the graveyard and um, and replace them with better corpses. And then for me to get better corpses, I need carrots. So, oddly enough, for me to improve my graveyard, I think I need carrot seeds. Uh, yeah. I mean, that's a weird thing to I get how weird that sounds, but like, that I believe is the case. All right, so 35 is about as high as I could get it for now. I don't think that there's, I'll, I'll, I'll double check. I don't think there's any other improvements that I can make here. Cause I don't, um, cause for me to make any additional improvements, I'm gonna need carved gravestones or grave monuments or marble gravestones. Like, I'll need to go up up tiers. Because uh, every, every every grave that is that could stand to be improved upon is already in stone tier, I think. This poor grave, right? Neglected. Yeah. Yep, that's as high as I can get it. Uh, all right. Cool. So let's go buy some carrot seeds and Fabby. Thank you for the um, the gift this up. Cheers. So if I recall, I need more cabbage seeds as well for the merchant. Uh, so that wouldn't be bad for me to buy while I'm down here. One, and like, let's just buy as many carrot seeds as I can afford. I'll probably regret spending as much as I just did, but yeah, whatever. Cheers. We got my carrot seeds. Oh, I should have bought one more carrot seed. Maybe I'll go back. I'll, I mean, you know, I'm going to pile up all my seeds in my inventory so I can see what I have. Um. But I'll get, I'll get what I have planted. Although it seems like it's about to be nighttime, so I'm going to lose the... Um, lose... Okay, how the... Trying to plant where I intend to has been excessively hard for me. <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's see if he's still there. Do I have a chance to get more carrot seeds if I plant in better soil? I have no idea. What I I do know is that I've been fertilizing the soil. Um, I suppose with the assumption that that is the case, but not with data. I I, I don't know. Okay, I don't have the money for this, so let's buy the. 
Beet seed. And that's the last. Wait, did it? I have 12 copper. It costs 12 copper. And it won't let me buy it. <sighs> Fractional pennies. Damn you! Alright, I guess I won't be doing that. Have I explored the dungeon at all yet? No. I have not. It's been a while since I checked on the um, apiary. I don't know if uh, uh, I don't know the cooldown for this, but let's go check. And maybe get stung by bees. One of those coppers are crooked. They all crooked, man. So I think that except for the except for me exhuming corpses out of the current graveyard, there's not a way to make it better. And the thing is, with my current um, because the graveyard's not at capacity, I'm going to assume that it makes more sense to just add more corpses than to exhume them, right? Because if I spend money on an exhumation order, or I can spend money on carrots for more corpses, at least for now, it makes more sense to just spend more money for carrots um, until the thing is basically filled. And that also will give me the corpse uh, resources. You know, that's going to give me like blood and, and allow me to practice better surgery or experimentation on um, on embalming. So that's probably the route I'm going to go. Is, you know, to... Yeah. I think I've explained that enough. So, putting everything else away. So I'm trying to think, you guys said that like firewood was a pretty decent thing to sell if I wanted to sell stuff. So I'm gonna unlock woodcutter. And start cutting down the bigger trees and selling firewood for seed money. That's going to be my strategy, because I, I don't know how to make money in this game, like, effectively, but I also don't care. I'll just do it how I know how, rather than whatever meta is. I don't want that spoiled, so. That's my plan. Make firewood for sale, and then I know that the game has, like, an economy system, so once I sell enough firewood, I'm not going to be getting good money from it, so I'll figure out something else that I can sell, but, uh. But, but that's the plan. Because for now, uh, I need to wait for the... Um, for the astrologer to show up at the lighthouse in order to buy the pen and ink. So I'm just passing the time doing something that I think will be productive towards the end goal.
It's a weird thing to mass produce. But why not? How bad was this storm? My place is okay. Yeah. It was, it was not great. But I avoided the worst of it. The saw table will yield more? Alright, that's good to know in the future. I think I've already committed the billet, though, right? Thank you for tuning in to Graveyard Keeper, which originally streamed live on Twitch August 16th. If you have any feedback or questions for me, let me know in the comments below. If you'd like to catch a live stream of mine, Rodamont.com has my stream schedule and countdown timers to have a coming stream. If you would like to join my online gaming community on Discord, a link can be found in the description of this video and also on my website, Rodamont.com. Thank you so very much for watching, and a special thank you to my Patreon patrons, Twitch subscribers, and viewers like you that support the channel and made it all the way to the credits. Thank you so very much. Hope to catch a next episode or an upcoming stream. Farewell, my fellow graveyard keepers.